everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Michelle with Bella Branch DIY and I'm so glad you're here. I hope everyone's having an awesome day. I have some really cute DIYs for Valentine's Day which is quickly approaching and I wanted to make it really easy and affordable and some of these are actually free projects and I'm going to give you the printables for those and then you can just print them at home so you can make them last minute. So are you guys ready? Let's go. We're going to be making a lot of the items that are in this gift basket. Project number one is a DIY Valentine coupon. And the printables are free for you guys. You just have to go to the link in my description and then you can download them for free. So I put dotted lines on the printout so that you'll be able to cut along there to cut your coupons and just go through and cut all of the little coupons. These Valentine coupons turned out so darn cute and I had so much fun making them for you guys and I hope you guys love them. So you're gonna take them and stack them up and then take some ribbon or I'm using red and white butcher twine that I had left over from Christmas and you're just gonna tie it in a bow. And we're gonna use this later to add into our little gift basket. Next project are Valentine cards. And again, I have free printables for you guys. Just download those and cut them out. And I'm gonna show you how you put them together to make them really unique and very cute. So I took two different cards and then I took some washi tape and I put that across the, um, the middle of the two cards. And then I took that and snipped the edges. And then I'm gonna take washi tape and put half on one side and flip it over and put the other half on the other side. And then I'm gonna snip the excess. And that's one idea for the cards. Next, I'm gonna show you an idea that I love with ribbon. And this ribbon is a velvet ribbon. And I think it's so darn cute. And I hope you guys love this Valentine card. So again, I'm gonna take two different cards, open them up, use the washi tape in the center of the card, trim any excess. And then you can use it, either use glue or what I used was rolling tape. put that on there and then I just added the velvet ribbon on both sides and there it is those turn out so cute project number three is a clay marble jewelry dish and actually I have two versions one says you and me and one has some imprints of hearts and you're gonna take your um, Sculpey or female clay and you're gonna roll it out into little uh, strips then roll them together, twist them up, flip it over, and roll it back into a ball. And then you're gonna press it down, and then roll it out. If you don't have a little rolling pin, you could use a, a mug or a cup. Then I wrote out the word you and me on a piece of paper, and rolled out some black Sculpey clay. And then I just uh, put that on the center of the uh, what's gonna be a bowl and I think it looks so cute. And then again, I'm gonna roll it out. And then here's another version, I added some black into it. And then I took some more black and cut out little hearts. And I have a tiny little um, stamp that I can use, but you can, just, you can just cut them out freehand. And then you're gonna take those and you're gonna push them into the clay. And then again, roll it really quick. Then you're gonna cut it out using a bowl as a template. Take that off and then put it into another bowl to make it shape. And then bake it for 275 for 15 minutes. And then let it, let it cool first. And then you're gonna take a tiny paintbrush and some gold paint and paint the edges. That turned out so cute. What a cute ring dish. Project number four is a hanging love sign. And again, free printer bowl for you guys and I have six different ones for you guys to choose from so you can you can make a bunch if you want look how cute these are what cute Valentine gifts and again free printable go into my description for a link to the downloads now 
This is cool. What I did was I took paint, painting sticks, painter sticks, and I cut them to size. Now, you, if you don't have a saw, you can do it by hand or you can do it actually in Home Depot or Lowe's. They have a little saw stand that you can do it. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the pieces after I've cut them and I'm gonna sandwich them, uh, sandwich the sign in between two um, cut sticks. And then I cut some twine because that's where you're gonna hang it from and I'm gonna sandwich that in on the top part. So then you put more hot glue and then put the other painter stick on top. And then just repeat the same steps on the bottom. These are so cute. And that says two hearts in all the different languages there, and I love you. Next, we're gonna take a little basket and we're gonna put some little shredded craft paper in there. And I found a little bottle of rosé and some little wine or champagne glasses that have little gold dots, which was so darn cute. I found those at Michael's, by the way. And then I'm gonna take my little ring dish and put that in there. And then my little coupons for my Valentine. And then the little card is the last thing that I added. Oh, not the last thing. Then I added a rose because I just thought that was so cute. And then one more thing, I took washi tape and put it on the back of the coupon so that it held uh, still in the basket. I hope you guys love today's DIYs. I think they turn out great. Honestly, they can be projects that you make for yourself and they don't necessarily have to be for Valentine's Day. Like I have one of my signs up here that probably will stay up all year long because why not? It's really just talking about love so that can be up all the time. I hope you guys loved all the projects today and don't forget the free link below um, for the free downloads for the printables is there. and. As always, I love when you guys comment because I get back to every single comment. Be sure to give it a thumbs up if you like today's DIYs. And until next time, happy Valentine's Day. Oh, and one more thing. I'm going to have another Valentine's video coming out in a few days. And I'm going to show you as one of them how to put an embroidered heart on a sweatshirt. Until next time, bye.